what are the main taxes I need to register for and how do I register? And a secondary part, which is very important, is when and how often do I need to pay these taxes or file information? Okay, that's a great question. We get those questions all the time. So just like we're talking about learning today, depending on how you plan to operate your business will determine your tax responsibilities. Um, far as sole proprietorships, which is like an individual, you're not going to be subject to franchise tax like maybe an LLC or corporation is. So in Texas, franchise tax means it's a business tax imposed on doing business in Texas, um, either formed or doing business in Texas, per se. Um, we do set you up, you know, once you get registered with Secretary of State's office for that uh, Texas taxpayer number. And you'll be subject to filing these reports uh, once a year. And I always tell people you file these regardless if you have any taxes to report, you still file it to show that you filed for that particular period. Um, but we do mail you information about that and you could always call us and we can tell you all more about that if you have any questions. But it does not mean you're a franchisee. <laughs> we get that question all the time. Uh, the second part, well, another on top of another type of tax would be, of course, sales tax. And this is for an entity or individual making sales of taxable items, um, providing taxable services. We consider you engaged in business in Texas if you're doing that here. And yes, you need to have a sales tax permit. Um, depending on what you're doing, of course, you know how you register will tell you in the beginning how you're set up to be filing like a um, monthly, quarterly, sometimes even yearly. But we'll tell you all that once we get you set up. But yes, you have to apply for a sales tax permit. So those are two main taxes that come about operating a business here in Texas.